here is the village of Hyde Park. That's a garage. Right there is my post office. That's a house. This building is the library. That building straight ahead is the courthouse. This is the garden. It's 4.35, my video is done exporting, and uh, now I'm going to take a nap. Shalom, it's 4.48 right now, I just got my palette. Dan and Robin are in Hyde Park, so I mean I would be going there anyway because I have pallets, but I just ran into the co-owners of the Alchemist and they said, hi, we saw your video of what you do with all our pallets. And then they told me they have like a giant pool cover that could be easily used as a tarp that they want to recycle and they offered to let me walk through the brewery and see if there's any materials that they're recycling or getting rid of that I would want to reuse. And I was like, yeah, that's awesome. And then I got into the greenhouse and the Feast of Tabernacles a little bit, which was an excellent thing, as always. Everything the Most High does is excellent. Here's my fort that I just started. Over here, right there is Dan and Robin's bus. And this is the path that goes to the car. Okay, so there's the car, and there's the next property marker. Right up here. It's a little garden snake. Um, and I found this. So that was laying down here by the pond on top of the culvert. Mom, it's 4.30. I'm at Cumbies right now. I just got gas. I got nice coffee. Okay, so this is my dollar store haul. All this stuff is $1 from the Dollar Tree. Um, these are the big containers, and these ones have white lids. So I got, I think I got 10. This is a glass candle holder, and I figured I could fill it up, like almost to the top with water, and put tea light candles in it, and I should be able to fit four of them, and they'll float in here. So I got four of these because when I went to visit my brother Paul, who's younger than me, who's never been in my videos, um, I was talking to his girlfriend about how tea light candles float in water and he should always put them in water because one time I didn't and then the house caught on fire because of me. And so I was like telling her different ways to do tea light candles in water and have them float and look really pretty. She was like, oh yeah, that sounds so cute. And so I was thinking I could stop by there and like do a little candle setup for her. Hi, right, these are honey buns. These are cheddar chips and sour cream and onion because I gave some snacks to Dan and Robin, but I just need to replenish them. 
Um, I got pens in a journal because you already know I love freaking journaling. I love pens. This is going to be for my health. I have to write down everything I eat, what time I eat, um, and some other information, how I feel after I eat, all that stuff. Next, I got these for the campers. These are regular phone chargers. They can also charge the lanterns. Looks like that. Not for an iPhone. Um, and I got green color. I got blue. This is actually like a purple periwinkle kind of color. I don't know if it's really coming up on camera. Um, and I got a bright pink one. So I got one package of these. And those will be obviously in the candle holder. And next, I got these five hour burning candles for emergency lighting. And there's six of them in here. And I've never seen these. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to grab them since I'm here and shopping anyway. I got three of these lighters, the candle lighters, and I would like one to go in each camper that has candles so that you guys can light them. And then I got two of these, and I'm gonna put a regular lighter in each camper. So yeah, that's it. That's all I got going on right now. My family wants to talk to me. I got to my family's house and they wanna have conversation with me because they haven't seen me for days because as I've explained before, I just take off. <laughs> like, you never know when I'm coming back. <laughs> Eventually, but you never know exactly when. And nobody here calls me. People only call me, like, when they want something. Or, like, I guess if an emergency happens. So, yeah. That's, that's what's going on. Mm. Shall I? This is a cake stand. <coughs> that I got for $2 for the yard sale today. It's glass, all glass. Then, if you take the lid off and flip it over, it has a place for dip in chips or some, you know, some kind of dip in vegetables or whatever you want. That would be so great for a veggie platter. With a lid on it, of course, to keep the flies out. Yep. And then, if you want to, you could flip this over this way and use it for a punch bowl. Um, and I emptied all of my jars. I have this one left with coconut, and I have this one left with ginger, but I wouldn't put the crystallized ginger in here because this is basically just dry food storage and the ginger is covered in sugar. I feel like it's too sticky and I don't want it in plastic. Their day, this one has ramen in it. The other day, I emptied this one out which was filled with beans. And now I have this unit that has these smaller black boxes. This one actually has, that bag is coconut, but this is like vinegar and stuff. This one is spices and tea. This one is candy. This one is dried fruit and nuts. Um, and I don't know what's in the bottom. Bunch of stuff. 